what level are you really on? What level are you really on? It's only going to be a few people that truly, truly understand this video. I heard many people talking about when they get to heaven, the level they're going to be on, the crowns. Let me put it to you this way. So many people are talking about heaven so much that they cannot figure out how to live and be blessed on earth. I'm going to let that sink in for a minute. Oh, when I get to the other side, I'll, I'll, I'll. see I messed up a lot of my thinking is. Not understanding that right here on earth, there is a way to live and be truly blessed. Everybody think they got to wait till they get on the other side. You've been brainwashed. How can I sit here and talk about being blessed in the afterlife if I can't figure out how to be blessed right here? See, this don't make sense to some people, but some it will make sense. Because if you listen to a lot of these preachers, They'll tell you everything got to happen in the next life. Sad thing about that is how many people going to even make it? See, ain't no need for me talking about heaven if I can't show you in this life right here that there are blessings. It's like making baby steps. You don't start off knowing everything. But as you gradually grow in the Holy Spirit, you learn. You adapt. You move up. In this life. So many people talking about the level that they own. What level are you really on? That's why I want to title this video. What Do you even know the season that you are in? And I'm not talking about winter, spring, summer, fall, outside. I'm talking about in your life. See, so you got to get to the point where you stop listening to all these people telling you it's your season when it ain't your season. Because Ecclesiastes chapter 3 teaches us there is a time and a season for everything under heavens. Time to plant. Time to pluck up what you plant. You know how many people talking about they it's harvest time and they ain't even planted anything? They ain't put in no work. And they talking about a certain level that they on? You ain't on no level. The Holy Spirit also showed us how to live in this life and be tremendously blessed. But we've been taught the ways of the world. You got to get a degree. You got to go to college. You ain't going to be successful if you don't get a, get a degree. We let this world dictate everything in our life from when we was little all the way up to when we become grown. You've been taught this system. And when this, you don't work that way, you don't know, you don't even know what to fall on. Oh, but see, Brother Rodney, Brother P.P. Drawings, been talking about this for years now. How to operate and use the Holy Spirit system. When you use the Holy Spirit system, you are blessed in this life regardless of what the situation is. Regardless of a pandemic come or whatever, you will be blessed. People be looking like, how you get, well, how you get that favor on you? What is he doing I ain't doing? Well, what system is he using? I could look at Brother Rodney and see the level that he done came up on. But then I can look around and be like, hmm, they've been in church all their life. <laughs> Still up under this same preacher. 
still in that same building, still, still hearing them same messages. What type of level is you preachers on? I ain't talking about all. I can look at Pastor Cochran, Pastor Cochran and tell where he done elevated to. But if you sit up on the, what I talked about the other day, sitting up on the pastors who can't even grow. They don't even grow in their messages. So what are they going to teach you? They're going to teach you how to stay exactly where you are. I'm so sick of these, these so-called Christians walking around here with this just the mentality of it's just designed for me to be broke. I guess this the way God has it, man. You know the Bible say this, the Bible say that. What level are you on? Why are you talking about levels in heaven and you can't even deal with the levels on earth? I'll leave on that one. Shalom.